Watch the entire video my lovely viewers, I mean from start to finish, to get the whole thing. Without wasting much of your time, let's get right into it. Hi lovely viewers, it's me again, your one and only Mtati Mpundu. Welcome to my YouTube channel. If this is your first time on my channel, kindly subscribe to my YouTube channel by hitting the red subscribe button down below and turn the bell icon to join the notification squad. Don't forget to like, share and leave a comment. Tell me what you think about this video in the comment section below. I'll be super glad to hear from you lovely viewers. So, me I can't understand. I have just escaped. I don't know if it, like, if I can even call it an arrest or anything. But it was clear that when I was at Cheston Police, those police officers had the uh, had the intentions of picking me up. I don't know what was going to follow because look, I first uh, if I can give you the background, the background is that. I was called to bring the cable that was used to tie my gardener, the footage, and also come with my gardener and myself. Now, so I was not able to, to, to go there. That was, I think, on Friday. So I said, let me come on Monday, 10 hours. And that's how we went there at 10 hours. When we arrived there, we went into the CIO's office. Who, the, who is the one who called me? And I found him, he was having a meeting with the uh, officer in charge. The moment I arrived, the officer in charge left the office and went into his office. And their offices are just next to each other. I told him, we have brought the footage, we have brought the cable, and this is the uh, my garden. He said, okay, just hold on a bit, I'm coming. That's how he went into the next office of the officer in charge. He took him some minutes and then he came back and he said just wait the officer in charge has just stepped us stepped out um he will be coming back just to just wait about 20 minutes he'll be back now i knew that the officer in charge was in the office because i saw him going into the office and i saw the the cio going into the office and he, the door was open i never saw him walking out and this is upstairs so he didn't fly from his office i knew he was in the office but then the cio is telling me he has just stepped us stepped out he will be coming back in 20 minutes which was clear to me that they were waiting for whatever they were waiting for so i just told my my gardener to say let's go and that's how we 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 left the place got into the vehicle and and left now I've been arrested so many times. They have taken me so many times. I know the tricks. I know where. Is this? And I am very sure there the intentions were not good. The intentions were not good. I'm very sure about it because we had given a statements already. They wrote our statements, and they only asked now bring the footage. So, so I'm I'm very sure the intention was something else. But the question that I'm asking is, why is it that I've turned out to be the the suspect or the criminal when I'm the one that was attacked? I can't understand this. Eh? I can't understand this. And look, if today they got they got us together with my garden. They get the footage, they get my gardener, they get the cable. Where would the evidence? Eh? From my point of view, it looks like they want to they want to uh, you know to erase the, the the evidence. Because it's not it doesn't make sense. It doesn't make sense. Why do they want to arrest me? What have I done? And they are saying, well, you are you, you, you are putting the army into whatever. The question is, even when, whenever a crime happens, the police usually ask you, they ask you, who do you suspect? They usually ask you, who do you suspect? And you give the people that you, 
you suspect you give you give the suspect you give the, you give police you clues and according to us we have given them the clues that those people they are from the army for simple reasons number one the guns that they had the guns that they had those guns are not used by even ordinary police officers they are not they are not used even ordinary soldiers you don't see them carrying those guns then number two the cable that they use it is not a common cable that you see around the cable that they use to tie to tie to tie in my garden it is not a cable that you see around number three themselves themselves said it tell your boss investigation somebody says let them let him stop talking about the army which criminal with no interest with the army would come to my house wanting to kill me and tell me let him not talk about the army how how and then the other point is when you are shooting in the air criminals usually run away they run those people they were do they even said does he know who we are does he know who we are for him to be shooting the other point which criminal do you see after leaving a scene of crime puts a gun on his head on his back and drives freely at the back of a van which criminal does that where does that i mean it's just it can't happen which criminals do that eh? so everything from our point of view is pointing to the army it's pointing to the army and this is a clue it is now up to the police to investigate and tell us to say well it is not the army but here are the criminals otherwise there is no way you can turn me into a, a villain when i'm a victim here eh? i can't understand they want to arrest me why do you want to arrest me why do you want to arrest me what have i done what crime have i committed in my own country i'm turning to be a a, 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 a fugitive a fugitive I, I mean i'm not a fugitive i'm not running away i'm here eh? what, what's going on what is going on me i can't understand you and your governance eh? this is nothing about what me doing something wrong this is all about you trying to shut me up trying to shut me up and you say yo you talk too much i talk too much what do i talk about even you by you pnd kada who would like to say hey you talk too much what is it that i say that you should kill me for tell me what i've done that you want to kill me for what is it that i've said that you want to kill me for what is it eh? on the on, on on what was that on friday itself they came to my house wanted to to arrest me they wanted to beat me they stayed one hour outside my yard waiting for me come on this is just not right i mean some of you you can even support this whatever whatever but i'm telling you today it's me tomorrow it might be you this is how dictatorship operates dictators you know you can be there saying no 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 it's okay it's true for it's true for they are following but when they will come for you you will be you you'll be sorry this is really unacceptable it's really really unacceptable i can't believe it eh? It, they called me to the police not really to continue investigating they called me there because they want to arrest me it is clear they are not interested in investigating this case what they want is me they know and if indeed those people were common criminals if indeed those people were common criminals i'm i'm sure you know government would have somebody would have said something but everyone is quiet why is everyone quiet why is everyone quiet what happened here it's something big it's not small you can't take this lightly people with those heavy machine guns coming to my house jumping the war fence and you take it that it's likely well you can think that no it's just for diary but this is dictatorship this is dictatorship and we will start disappearing people will start dying because i would have been dead by now it is very unfortunate anyway i've i've left the police i've come back home I've come back home if you want. Come to my home. I've come back home. Thank you. This is DJ Mutati exclusive.
all right that's all right for you today lovely viewers if you did enjoy the video please don't forget to leave a comment in the comment section below tell me what you think about the video you just watched in the comment section below i'll be super glad to hear from you lovely viewers once again i go by the name of mutatim pondum i love you peace i gotta go